What's up, it's your boy Mega Cisco. We're in Little India. We're starting our day. We had a late start, but it's all for a good cause. The first mission right now, we can get some Indian food. I know we had Indian food yesterday. We're in Little India. It's straight up India, man. It's really nice. It smells different, and like the I would say the diversity has changed and shifted toward the Indian continent. But other than that, we're gonna go look around, see what we can get. India and also we're gonna check out Sentosa without a ticket so fun stuff the Sun is beaming it said it was me thunderstorms someone lied to us but we'll see <laughs> all right let's go okay I know it's a little loud in here but we're in little India and we found some food this is a cool food floor. My gosh. So I don't even know what we're gonna get. We're probably gonna be basic about it and get other chicken again. I don't care. It's gonna be great because if the Indians are eating here, we're eating here. Eat where the locals eat. Mega Cisco, travel tip right there. Eat where the locals eat. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Okay, so it's alright. I'm seeing the locals here. They're sweating and it's alright. That means they're hot too. It's a natural human thing. We decided to go with hot Kashmiri delights for our Indian food. We did get butter chicken and tikka masala. So and uh, what what Kashmiri naan and cheese naan. So and the way they cooked it was pretty amazing. They just like threw it inside this burning barrel and made it work. This is lunch. Great. <laughs> yeah. So whew, we'll go back to the real world after exploring. Gastrointestinal curiosities, then more exploration. So we just finished like 15 bucks for a worth of food at the Tekka Center, bomb.com. For that much money, we got two chicken plates and two naan and like a drink and drink. And right behind us, is a little indie arcade. Arcade not being a an operative term for like coin operated arcade, which I was kind of hoping for, but it's more like you know, an assortment of shops. But we're gonna keep walking around, show you a little bit of uh, this world here. Anything Pokemon Go wise, what are you looking at? A not shiny rabbit, not shiny rabbits. It is Good Friday, so that being said, I'm not sure how it's uh, the holiday is working, so uh, but yeah. I love the architecture here, very old school colonialism. Yo, what's up? It's your boy Mike Zisco, Alaska's only traveling YouTuber, and I ran into some some folks you might know. Yeah. Hey, it's Nick from Trainer Tips, and I was told I could show this off to you. I hope you can see that. It's a little bright out here. <laughs> it's a little bright, yeah. You're in the shade. <laughs> hey, I'm Zoe, Zoe Two Dots from Australia. I have nothing to show off because I didn't get a shiny Lapras, but I'm loving it here. It's hot as hell. So, how are you coping for Alaska? I think it's really nice. <laughs> That's a good question. Um, most of my videos are basically, basically me complaining about how hot it is. Nice. Um, we don't get this kind of weather in Alaska, so... Um, I imagine. Yeah, it's just you know, a little bit cooler there, so... But you manage. I mean, you're from California? Yeah, LA. LA. Does it get humid like this? No. No, this you just, is it gets... I don't ever look like this at home. <laughs> okay, all right. What about Oz? It's Where in Oz? The same in Newcastle, so like near Sydney. Okay. Probably similar temperature for heat, but the humidity is insane here. Like Northern Australia, yeah, okay, humid, but like I'm sweating like crazy. So. Yeah, I'm, I'm not looking forward to the, my tan lines. Oh, mine's already so... I've got like a backpack tan from this all day yesterday. I'm like... I get one of those every yeah. that I go to. But how was the grind yesterday? Were there a lot of people? Like A lot of people, yeah. a lot of sun. Everyone's like hiding in the shade. Yep. Okay, so should we bring like, you know, Asian people umbrellas or? Mm. Yeah, honestly, yeah, it would have been nice to have. If you got a spare hand, yes. yes. Okay, because like, I remember in Japan, were you in Japan? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. all right. That but luckily it was like overcast in yeah. Yokosuka most of the time. Yeah. yeah. But you heard her here first, she might go to Alaska, you know, all the way down south. So that being said, she's going to bring some regionals, nudge nudge. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to Bowlby. Yeah. I host a trade Tuesday, so you know, not mean. Let's 
do it. All right. Well, thanks for your time, guys. And thanks for showing off that Lapras. Yeah. Yeah, party. Might see you soon, Alaska. <laughs> you know, I'm probably going to get dinged with a copyright infringement, but there's Shania Twain playing in the background of this bar behind me. And it's the Countryside Cafe. Unwind, indulge, recharge. All the adjectives I would describe. And they have all the American foods here. And... I feel profiled. <laughs> yeah. Colorado. So yeah, I mean, I'm not complaining. This is, uh, <laughs> I don't have to say really, it's something. So cultural fun fact, this is a mini KTV, that's so like Korean TV or karaoke TV, I don't know. One of the above. Uh, this is crazy. You can walk in here and sing a karaoke song, have it recorded. 15 minutes, six bucks. 30 minutes, 10 bucks. And yeah, it's a mini studio. What? <laughs> what is this? This is amazing. <clears throat> we got some boba tea. Um, Nicole is one less in boba tea debt. We decided to get some takoyaki here at Dobie Gout. I don't know how to say it, but I've been growing with it. And it's an amazing shopping complex just in the bottom of a random, seemingly random train station. What I am doing is becoming best friends with lots of people, Umi and hatching eggs, but there seems to be a lot going on. There's a little crap ton of Latios raids that just like popped. It's a Finian gay, and yeah, we're just gonna enjoy our boba tea, our takoyaki, and we're gonna go upstairs and see if we can catch a raid and go to the park that Nicole wanted to go to. All right, <clears throat> all right, the night's over. It's popping. Just wanna let you know what we did at the end of the night. We went to this park, I forgot the name of the park, but we spun a lot of poke stops out there, and it was great. It was hot and sweaty, but we got bit by bugs. It was not good. So we left that, and then we decided to get fancy and have some drinks. And then after that, we got some saute at Boon Tat Street, and we are finished with that, and now we're on our way back. I just wanna let you know that Singapore's like area of effect is just so small. It's just trying to get to like be around this area just to be able to interact with the stop. But the sweat is getting in my eye. I'm winking at you. Not because I'm winking at you, but it's just because I don't want to wipe my sweat. <laughs> okay, but it's been a wonderful night. I want to say I had really great company. And yeah, okay, I'm wiping now. Will you always be excellent? See you next year on Char.